Hey everybody, this is Adam Gusso from Modern Blues Harmonica, continuing our series of lessons for the new year. Happy 2020, everybody. Um, wow. So, I want to talk about a, a technique that I, I'm, a, I'm a, a guy who does a lot of things lip first. I love tongue blocking, but I'm not a full-time tongue blocker. I use it when I need to. There's a couple of things that I don't think tongue blockers can do, but I know you'll let me know if you're a tongue blocker, and you'll direct our attention to uh, you know videos where tongue blockers do this. Um, and this is what's called double tonguing. Um, it's a trumpet technique, and there's actually triple tonguing too. What does it sound like? So that's double tonguing. Now I'm not going because if I were doing that, I'd be basically articulating. It's all one breath, by the way. Everything I'm doing is just one breath coming through, and are you articulating with your tongue? Okay. And one way to articulate is simply to tap it like this. But double tonguing is a little different. So this is this is single tonguing. This is tonguing, single tongue. Double tonguing, and that's definitely a different sound. It's kind of cool, isn't it? So how am I doing that? Well, what I'm doing is I am actually my tongue is going back and forth. I'm exaggerating, but it's going wa da 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 da. It's actually moving back and forth. So the, I think the way to do this is to try to make the sound without the harp. And if I make that sound, I can't get you inside my mouth, and that would be kind of gross anyway. You don't want to be there. Um, but we can make the sound. And really what you do is you open your mouth, and you go wa da da and you draw in, and you go wa da 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 Just do that. wa da 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 And what you're doing is you're... It's um, it's actually much easier if I th do it this way. Wa da 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 So we're going to call this the wa da 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 rhythm. Double tonguing. Now there's triple tonguing, by the way. Um, these things are all borrowed. Uh oh, could be the cops. Could be the cops. Who's this? Who is this? Hold on, I'm going to turn it off. Could be the cops. It is a car looking at me. Those of you who've been with me since the beginning will remember that back in 2007, good God, 12 years ago, one of the most popular videos I ever did on this, uh, the other YouTube channel of mine was one in which a cop uh, came up to me when I was sitting in my car at the crossroads, and I was like, hello, Mr. Officer, everything's okay. Everybody thought that was hysterical. I have no idea why. Is, is harmonica that dangerous? Anyway, the wide data rhythm. So... So you, you're, you're drawing in, but here's the thing, you could say without really doing the back and forth brushing of the roof of the mouth thing with your tongue, but that's what you have to do, you have to do the back and forth, and it'll have that sound, blowing out, I don't know. It's not nearly as effective blowing out. It's most effective on the four draw. I think that's what Sonny Terry uses, double tonguing. So how would you do this? It's kind of in a jump blues at a jump blues tempo. Oh boy. Well, that kind of thing, it's not really my, this is not actually a technique that I use very often, 
but it's good to know it's out there. That's it. This is the Wada Data technique. Wait a minute. That's double tonguing. Triple tonguing? I'm not sure I can do this. So triple tonguing would be... <laughs> I'm coming back with another video. That deserves its own video. I hope you're tempted. So look for Gusso triple tonguing sometime soon. Coming soon to a theater near you. All right. Bye-bye. Have a good one.